Hey now, Leaf Hitter here with a guide to jungling Marana. And by jungling, I use that term kind of loosely again because we're going to head towards the Ancients. Patch 6.86 is here, and with it we have oodles of fun changes, not just to heroes, but also the map itself. One of the most notable is that each team's secret shop, we have a new hard camp to play with. We also have some cheaper starting items, Quilling Blade, a little bit discounted now, and finally, some Marana buffs. Not only does she have a longer attack range, now, when Sacred Arrow hits a creep, it'll just insta-gib it. All of these changes stack up to make Marana a new darling of the jungle. Go ahead and start with a Q-Blade, Circle, and Slippers, because we're going to be building an Aquila rather quickly, and make your way over to the Ancient Camp. You'll need to cut down these three trees inside the Ancient Camp to make stacking from across the way possible. Now, the rest of these trees don't really need to be cut, but I prefer my forest to be a little well-kept. It makes things a little bit easier, gives you more vision. Um, you could definitely be helping your team secure the rune during this time, which is probably more useful. Make sure when 30 seconds hits you are far enough away from the new camps that you do not block the spawn, and then position yourself to arrow down the big creep. Once you kill him, just go ahead and keep on kiting around and auto-attacking whatever's left in the camp, and let the courier bring your wraith band out. If you can't finish off the hard camp in time to stack, don't worry, it's not a problem. Just go ahead and drop the aggro and be ready to stack the Ancients of 53. That's the important part. Once you do that, it's super easy just to go back up and pull the hard creep down. Now we just need to do a little bit more of the same. Go back, kill the hard camp again, keep bringing your items out, make sure that you're done in time to stack the Ancients once more. You need a triple stack, that's what you're looking for. So you're going to want to kill the hard camp one last third time, and then position yourself to leap up onto the cliff. I'll slow it down here so you can get a better view of how to properly leap onto the cliff. It's really easy. You just need to be walking towards it and then jump in between the little puddle and the little white bush. Now this is where the real magic happens. Just relax and farm the ancients. Make sure to prioritize the large golems first and then the big dragon second because of their auras and it'll make everything else easier to kill. And be careful not to stand too far close to the edge because the ranged ones will definitely attack you. We still need to be killing the hard camp for that extra little boost, so use your arrows to farm the largest creep while auto-attacking the others down so that you get a new spawn every minute. Careful with your HP, though, because if you stand too close to the edge and then aggro them towards you, the interaction's a little weird, they'll auto-attack you up the cliff, kind of sucks. And just be patient with your arrows. Sometimes if the big creep is hiding behind his little friends, it'll be easier for you just to kill the little ones and then arrow the big one later. You don't want to mess up. You really can't afford to lose 100 mana. Let the courier send you out your boots of choice. I go phase here with that little extra damage. I'm able to hit level 6 before 6 minutes. And you know what? It's really that easy. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to have much more regular content now, especially with the new patch out. And it might be stuff that's actually a little more realistic. Follow me on Twitter at Leaf Eater. Thanks. You're awesome.